Our next recipe is Thai fish cakes or Tod Man Pla. Generally in Thailand, we prefer to use featherback fish for this recipe. But if you're abroad, you can replace it with Chinese mackerel. We will only use the fish meat, which we will thoroughly mix with the other ingredients before kneading. We will mix fish meat, roasted curry paste, egg, chopped kaffir lime leaves, salt and sugar. For the dip, we need sliced cucumber, pounded peanuts, pounded red chilies, sugar, vinegar and salt with coriander leaves for garnishing. Before we start kneading the fish, let's make the dip. On a medium heat, mix all the dip ingredients and wait until the sugar and salt are dissolved and the liquid is boiling. Upon boiling, transfer the dip base to a bowl and leave to cool. Now it's time to knead the fish. Like I said earlier, we will only use the fish meat. Knead it until it becomes firm. Then it's time to combine the rest of the ingredients. First, the roasted curry paste, then the egg. For seasoning, we use sugar and salt. Mix it all so that everything is well blended and the sugar and salt are dissolved. Now we add the fish meat. Knead this mixture until the texture becomes smooth and firm. Before we're done, add some kaffir lime leaves to the blend. A good tip to make it easier to form the fish cakes is to dip your fingers in a little cold oil. Into hot oil, add the fish cakes one by one. The dip base will now be cool and ready, and any that you don't need can be easily kept and used another time. To serve, add chilies to the dip in a mixing bowl, as much chili as you want. Then transfer to a serving bowl where sliced cucumbers are waiting. Top off with roasted peanuts. And garnish with coriander leaves. Here it is, the delicious Todman Plah.